Well, how's it going, YouTube? Today I'm looking at another beer sent to me by my buddy Ben. Thanks a lot, man. Today's beer is a Redline Brew House's Beer de Garde. It is a brown farmhouse style ale, 7.6% uh, alcohol by volume, 28 IBUs. Really, in really been enjoying uh, Redline's beers. Their IPA was out of this world. The brown ale was really nice. So, uh, yeah. Excited to get this one cracked poured, see how it is. The appearance on Redline's Beer de Garde, a finger of a off-white tan-ish head, a nice uh, deep mahogany color to it. Yeah, it looks really nice, gleams of purple coming through here and there. The aroma? <sighs> Maybe a hint of like licorice? Some farmhouse qualities, that funkiness from the Saison. A bit of a tart aroma as well. Yeah, some dark fruits. Smells quite nice. Cheers. Yeah, getting like a prune, a date, stuff like that. Some nice dried dark fruits, that kind of thing going on. Then a nice roastiness, uh, a hint of coffee. molasses, brown sugar, that kind of thing as well. Uh, pretty decent. I'm getting definitely that uh, sharp saison quality from this, that beer de garde kind of thing. Uh, it's pretty nice. Uh, yeah, I'm getting like a pear, an apricot, maybe a hint of apple, like a sweet apple. Um, yeah, decent beer. Uh, Nothing I'm falling in love with, nothing amazing, you know, but it's really drinkable, thirst quenching, nice mouthfeel to it, dry finish, uh, medium bodied beer. Uh, I'd go right around a straight up 80. It's good. Uh, again, not exactly my style. Uh, not a big fan of the lighter styles of. Belgian beers becoming dark, you know, stuff like that. But uh, this one's pretty nice. Again, that's Redline's Beer de Garde, straight up 80 from me. Uh, thanks for sending it out, Ben. Uh, appreciate it, and thanks everybody for watching. Cheers.